Hi, it's Double975, and welcome to Elite Dangerous on the Xbox. And today I'm going to be talking about the Humble Space Shotgun, the Frag Cannon. A lot of people frown upon the Frag Cannon use, especially gimbaled frags. Uh, they look down upon the use of gimbaled weapons in general, but frags in particular because they're spray and pray nature. Um, you know, there's a lot of pellets being dished out. If a lot of those pellets hit, they do a lot of damage. If a lot of those pellets don't hit, they don't do that much damage. Um, they don't take that much skill because you're basically looking to barrel stuff with them, shoot at very close range. Um, using drag frags is frowned upon in PvP tournaments. They're usually banned in PvP tournaments, which is kind of funny, which is why I've never entered my Ramba in a PvP tournament. I would love to, but I, no, I'm not going to sit there and try and mess around with the engineering every time I want to enter, enter a stupid PvP tournament because drag frags are banned because matter FDL pilots can't take a bit of drag frag um, and to be honest I'm flying a Mamba so the point of having the drag frag on there is to drag the FDL pilot down to my level where you're in an immovable brick especially my Mamba which is my stupidly heavy one um, but you know I haven't got any shield cell banks on my Mamba it's just frags and ramage and it does wonderful things to FDLs it does a lot of damage it's very brutal um, you know, I've beaten some of the, some of the better PVPers in this game in this ship. It's a great leveler for my lack of skill. <laughs> um, it's quite a joy to use. It's it's like persistently hunting them down, saving that boost to look to get a you know a frag ram in, um, and really do some damage, just big chunks of damage. Um, and yeah, if you hit with the frags alone, even without the rams, they do so much damage. They are so brutal. Um, but like I say, they're weirdly frowned upon because of, and drag frags weirdly, you know, uh, get banned. All of, have all the things in the game. Drag frags, just usually drag frags and seeker missiles that are the two things that are banned from tournaments. And um, I find that really funny. I think people should use four cell cannons more often to get them banned. But uh, yeah, I personally have a lot of fun using the frags um, for organic PvP and for one v ones with people. Not tournament ones, just agreed 1v1s. Because like I said, I can't tournament with it because in tournaments, Drag Frag is banned. Um, which is hilarious to me. Because it's the one great level of it, you know, a Mamba pilot can pull on an FDA pilot and go, like, you know, your ship's way more maneuverable, but let's see how you cope now I've made it into a bit more of a brick. And um, yeah, I'm going to just keep hitting you with Drag Frag over and over and over again, just sitting there waiting to get some rams in you know saving my boost at the right moment trying to vector match you just keep closing that distance to where the frags become relevant and you know that's the thing they're not the most amazing weapon in the world you're not always going to win because you know they, they haven't got much range they're a bit limited there are things people can do to negate them you know and it's not you know, an insta win by any stretch of the imagination is against a, a Meta FDL because a Meta FDL can out DPS me, and as long as he avoids the Rams, he should win. I have a one and done shield, he's got banks and stuff, he's got bank cancelling rails, he's got you know, plasmax. I think this is a 5 PA build, I'm not sure, but you know, out of all the ships out there, this is not an insta win by any stretch of the imagination. In fact, like, um, you know, 1v1 by we've um crates and phantoms are always a struggle in my ramba um, anything with really really good regen can be a struggle because they can just leap out and go get their shields back and you know come back so all in all it's not an insta win but against the right ship it's a really solid counter and i do just love using frags anyway that's all for this video um i thought i'd be nice and just end it there and say gg uh it was a fun one view one outside of shinny so no need to go to the death because you can just park up in the station repair and have another 1v1 afterwards. Always plenty of 1v1s around Shinny on the legacy version of Xbox. Lots of PvPers hang out up there. It's fun to pop down occasionally and um, hit them with stuff they don't have to face in tournaments because they ban it. 
Anyway, that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.